Hi there guys, uh, good evening from Dhaka, Bangladesh. Time here right now in Dhaka is about 6 p.m. Okay, and I'm at uh, one of our neighboring shop called Star World Metro Mall Dhanmundi. So I'll leave the link below of the page or the address. Uh, you can come to the Metro Shopping Mall. I think it's in Dhanmundi, everybody knows that. And I sadly don't have my mic today. So if you hear some noise and if you hear the sound is a little bit less, I apologize. But I have a few fragrances to show you. Initial impression, I have quite a few fragrances. And I have a couple of new fragrances, clones, which I'm very excited about. I'll show you one by one. So, Masum Bhai, thank you so much. Assalamu alaikum, Malwasan Bhai. Thank you so much for giving us time and letting us review, okay? So, guys, here is the collection for their perfumes, if you want to see. And their prices, obviously, like market price have gone up. A little bit more expensive than before. So, you come and try here, no problem. You don't have to buy if you try. But uh, the current market prices, they are giving still very competitive pricing. So I'll go from left side without wasting much time. I'll start with a couple of body sprays, okay? So the first one I have here is called X Signature. And this is a dual action in a, uh, technology. It's called Rouge or Rogue. Uh, I think I don't know how you say that, but Rogue. So this one is a body spray, but I think it's a less gas version. This is how the packaging looks. I just saw it, I thought I'd review it, okay? The green and black looks really nice. And these are very inexpensive. I think the price range from this or is thin show, Ashitaka means 380 taka which is like around four dollars i think okay so this one is a very nice fresh green perfume and the perfume is similar to something like polo green the bit animalic bit green uh, fresh uplifting and i think these x signature body sprays have good longevity so you can get easily two to three hours from it at least but if you overspray on the shirt perhaps you'll get four to five hours that's my assumption but i can't tell for sure this is not my bottle so this is good budget friendly fragrance for students or whoever is beginning the game Next one is a perfume I want to review very badly, Paco Rabanne Fame. So this, as you can see, this uh, uh, sort of like a sign or whatever, this is like the women's counterpart of Paco Rabanne Phantom. If I get the perfume, it's a beautiful bottle. I'll show you, but this is a body spray. Obviously, it's not as long lasting as the original EDT, but this is official uh, body spray. So it's a little bit more expensive compared to other body sprays. I think the price will be mentioned here somewhere. I don't know where the prices are. Uh, it's here, sorry. It's around 2,850 taka, almost 3,000 taka, which is equivalent to $30, which is not cheap. But if you see the perfume, the perfume, this one, the bottle, glass bottle, that will cost you about around $85 to $100 right now, which is expensive. So if you want to get a bit more budget-friendly version, you can get Fame. So the, uh, this one is like a tin can, nothing much to show. If, if you drop it, it's not going to break. But the smell is very, very amazing. When I smell this very nice floral perfume, like maybe freesia, peach, fruity floral. It's a non DNA, nothing groundbreaking, but it's a very pleasant perfume to wear. And I will tell you, if you get this body spray, you can wear this all year round, no problem. Just go a little bit heavy or carry it in your purse, you can respray, no problem. So third one is the women's perfume again, and this fragrance, it's a discontinued item. Very beautiful bottle, this is called Safari for Women, I think, okay, by Ralph Lauren. And this perfume is getting a little bit rare to find. Very vintage looking whiskey bottle kind of a bottle. Look at that artwork. It's a very beautiful bottle. And I don't know how much the bottle size. Masum bhai, it's a bottle size. It's a bottle size. It's a bottle size. 75 mil, right? Okay. A box stick to get it. Yeah, guys. Okay. Thank you so much, Masum bhai. So this is the box. If you see this, you'll recognize this. Let's say if you see it in a shelf like that, then you'll see. It looks like the men's one, but a bit smaller box. Okay. And this is 75 ml. So this perfume, it's kind of like, a, I would say, animalic, old school, floral. It's like female counterpart of Safari or uh, maybe Kuros, uh, Pakuraban, you know, those perfumes, Pakuraban Puram. It's a very, very powerful fragrance, really nice cap too. This is a bit rare to find and it's actually a bit more expensive than what it used to be. But I would tell you, this is a perfume worthy checking out if you like old school, vintage style perfume. So this is called Safari by Ralph Lauren for women. Okay, so yeah, the next one I'm gonna show you Bulgari. Uh, this perfume I have reviewed before but I never bought. It's called Bulgari Man uh, Glacial Essence. So they have a lot more in this line. If you see, they have uh, Neroli Essence, Oud Essence, Man in Black, Terra Essence. There are quite a few in this line. Some of them are discontinued, some of them are available. But this one right here is a freshie, okay? And it does smell a bit like Carolina Herrera 212. Uh, NYC and to my nose that's why I didn't like it much because it didn't feel like very original release but now I think it's a little bit less peppery uh, less green more cooling think of snow and a little bit freshness a little bit spicy 
watery kind of fragrance you can try it it's called glacial essence the bottle is nice i do not mind it it's not as um, like I, i'm not gonna call it a pass you can give it a try if you don't have 212 by carina herrera or you had it but you finished you can try this or upgrade it to uh, glacial essence this is the uh, fourth one fifth one here is this new perfume I'm very excited about and this is called you can tell from the bottle it looks very similar to versace eros eros they have here i will show you this is the versace is very on the top seller perfumes best fragrance from versace so if you find that one is a bit too expensive you can try this from alhambra mason alhambra many people ask me to review this house and uh, they have two actually i'll review next time they have versencia which is a clone of versace versens they also have clone of i think uh, chanel ali room sport okay they have clone of this fragrance and few of the other ones and this is very budget friendly within i think 15 16 dollars you can also find it elsewhere like 14 dollars 15 it's a budget perfume it's a clone house the bottle let me show you it's really nice green bottle looks identical to versace rose the cap is quite nice actually i like this cap a lot um, so this one smells very very close to rose very close to rose when you smell this you get the green um, like apple mint tonka and then vanilla that's the combination but it's a little bit more citrusy and less vanilla to my nose very close i would say 95 percent to 97 percent similar to uh, eros but their performance also very very good for the price next one i'm going to show you is called boss uh, number one this is the old version uh, this particular version you cannot find it anymore uh, they have shifted to more newer style bottle and i think the formulation changed a little bit back in the days this used to be spicy oak moss uh, perhaps leather i forgot but mostly a spicy fragrance like azaro purom barbershop style perfume this is the og fragrance of hugo boss this is the one that used to sell in 80s 90s men used to wear this now men of 50 they would like this perfume it's not for younger generation i feel this is a bit more like shaving cream shaving foam after shave sort of uh, the prices on these are not very expensive bhai eta uh, price range kiram ekhon boss ta boss juice ka is very nice 4800 4, a little bit discount will be given right if if you come and say like uh, we came from from bangladesh or joy bhai's page you can get some discount they used to be very cheap before it used to be 35 dollars around now due to the price increase still it's within 50 dollars which is good another thing is you cannot find this version everywhere so get it before you uh, run out of it in the market next one i'll show you is boss man this used to come in the hugo boss bottle orange uh, that bottle but they have upgraded to this i i like this bottle a lot very nice and this smells similar to that it has that orange woody mild spicy a very easy to wear perfume fresh every day summer spring okay longevity from this okay moderate to good but uh, this one the previous one lasts like six to seven hours so the man one i think you can get uh, if you let's say beginning the game or if you like hugo boss or try something new never tried this is a good way to start uh, the next one is very nice this is a vintage fragrances rebirth sort of look at the juice color it's pretty orange okay looks very nice same bottle as the other two but this is uh, the fragrance called in motion uh, i have the original version of it looks like this space ball sort of like you had to hold your spray that bottle you can find anymore and this one is a bit more refined i think it's a little bit more orangey the up top the dry down is very similar to the old one but the opening is different than the old version this is very pleasant you will get four to five hours from it office gym sport okay all right moving on to the next ones yeah that's not me that's the chair so by the way uh, next one is called hugo boss selection same line now this is the same series of hugo boss re-release okay it's called selection so i have this perfume this is the fragrance i would say back in the days people used to call this when dior sauvage was not around this used to be dior sauvage blood chanel this is office friendly perfume and it's also the same price range as the other ones 45 dollars perhaps this is a woody fresh uh, kind of you can say aquatic kind of blue a little bit uh, fresh um, like uh, if you like fragrances like say mont blanc individual mont blanc explorer similar style perfume mont blanc star walker is the same style perfume so this will be good for regular and formal usage <clears throat> next i think you have about five or six left next one it's a very pretty bottle i don't know if i showed it before it's polo blue perfume take a look at the bottle it's very pretty it's similar to polo blue but it has this uh, color hue you know it's like a bit dark here at the base it will come up a little bit transparent so it changes it looks like ocean uh, sort of like a you can say aqua, uh, aquatic sort of vibe 
and uh, perhaps an aquarium okay so this is a bit more concentrated than polo blue they do have polo blue also uh, polo blue looks like this if you know Ralph Lauren yeah this is the EDT version and this is the perfume and the perfume box looks like this so there are a lot of variation of this so make sure you know which one you buy so for me this one it's it's a little bit different than polo it's a little bit green a little bit blue it's very small similarity to the original but it smells more like Invictus some of the Invictus mix with polo blue uh, good performance this one feels like good performer five to six up okay so moving on to the next ones as you can see very beautiful bottle red bottle of Lamal uh, this is basically Lamal Christmas or Xmas edition I think 2021 or 2 I write down the names but this perfume it's good performer all the limited time release they last a long time and uh, if you collect these nobody else is gonna have this kind of bottles okay um, and it comes in a very nice uh, packaging also it has that Christmas uh, you can see the Christmas if you shake it uh, oh. you can see this beautiful snowflakes it's called snowflakes take a look at the effect it looks like snowing it looks like New York okay very beautiful packaging and these are a little bit more pricey than regular Lamal but it's worth the collecting it smells like mint uh, barber shop same same smell as Lamal uh, mint lavender um, think uh, vanilla and perhaps uh, tonka bean okay it's a bit mature smell but still lasts a long time it can work for the dating and all great fragrance for uh, gents the last four next one surprised me a lot this is Antonio Banderas King okay and this is called King of Seduction the bottle is not as nice as the power okay or there's a blue uh, by Antonio's blue seduction to that kind of so this is the most popular one that sells the most in Bangladesh okay if you see this one people buy 200 ml because very very cheap affordable entry band rest only issue is longevity a little bit but they smell very nice for the price that you get 20 something dollars right that range so this is good for students you can take it to a school bag gym bag for sporty purpose it's a good start of uh, for any fragrance collector let's say you find these ones a little bit more expensive this is a very uh, good upgrade from body sprays okay so king of seduction uh, it smells like pineapple lemon citrus and a little bit woody uh, nice masculine perfume very very nice all right so we have last three so i'm showing you this one called david of the game this fragrance i have the brilliant game that's the most beautiful one but this is also not bad this one has a gin and tonic smell a little bit woody a little bit green uh, fruity now you can see it's a bit old school smell like when this was released uh, this was a very unique bottle looks like casino chips okay like stacked together if you go to casino you'll see this kind of bottle uh, pattern a very cool bottle from Davidoff longevity from this is okay three to four hours but good for the price again um, give it a try the game okay so bit boozy bit uh, fresh green perfume so the last two we have uh, Armaf Q but this is not just the Q I review a few days back they all says Q but the main name is Umo. I don't know if you'll pick up the camera will pick up. I think it shows here yeah, Umo and I think it's called Umo EDP or the perfume concentration. Very beautiful bottle. I really like this bottle. Red, orange and black. So this is a very nice bottle and the price range again is $30, $35 I think not more than that. Affordable one. It's all sprayed in the paper. This smells like polo red to be honest. Right? the polo red smell like a QR muff little bit like polo red right? polo red moto. so if you do like polo red you can give it a try it's for women but I think men can use it it's a fruity red berries sweet kind of like coffee smell okay smell like this oh Masum Bhai is saying it's similar to bad boy to his lay perfume to his nose okay so you can use it if you're a man ladies can wear it too and it's a budget perfume from Armaf good looking bottle very good bottle good spray last but not least the most interesting one today is this perfume called smart collection and the code number is 410410 this is how the box looks this perfume you will not see everywhere I think these are from Middle Eastern country Dubai, Dubai. these are Middle Eastern country Dubai collection but look at the bottle juice color it's kind of like a green it's almost similar to polo uh, you put it side by side you see some similarity yeah similar to that but this bit more green and a bit gray so Masumi was saying, Joy Bhai, I cannot remember what this perfume is, but it's very familiar. So they have some of the other ones from this line. They have clones of, uh, I think, uh, 1 million and then other one is what, Bhai? <coughs> 262, one is 1 million clone, this one, and this is clone of Polo Green. 
so you can try this but i don't want to review I'll next day i'll review so this is a clone of bulgari's man in black to my nose you know i smelled it immediately it hit me it's similar to spice bomb and bulgari's man in black amazing very very close you know you will be surprised if you smell this you may think this is bulgari's man in black and for the price this is 2 25 $2, around 25 dollars price a little bit less can give you but if you like bulgari's man in black which is super expensive now almost 100 dollars okay and you like the smell but you can't afford it i suggest you come to star world and try this anywhere in the world if you have this collection give it a try it will be very good you can spray liberally this has good performance masumbai three to four hours three to four hours easy so for the price is not bad man in black will get you six seven hours for the price fraction of a price one fourth of the price you can get this one so this is a clone let me get a burger man in black then let me just put next to you those who know, know what i'm talking about this is a clone of this and this is discontinued super expensive if you wanted this you can get it for a budget and you can get multiple bottles you can use all day so those are the reviews once again you can give them a try and i have reviewed quite a few fragrances so the video is a bit long but you can come to star world and just like me you can spray on the paper and you can try some of the you complain like you know some shop don't let you try uh, star world is very friendly and they let you try perfume before buying if you don't like you don't have to buy right masumbai yeah. okay so he is one of the most friendliest persons so masumbai is always here at the perfume section and it is star world uh, this is the entrance from the main road and you can just come come to your right and you can come to star world so i think i'll end it here let me show you the collection once again yeah you can just take a screenshot and come back okay and then you can see they have other products as well they have shampoo um, all the all the other products you need women's products food items chips drinks they have uh, beauty products this is also part of their shop so you can come and visit star world anytime and uh, i think i will just call it a day hopefully you enjoyed the review take care i'll see you soon bye bye